Hi and welcome back to the Migro YouTube channel. My name is Shane and I'm the founder of Migro. Today we're going to look at LED selection for grow lights. In particular we're going to use a very very popular LED which is the Cree CXB3590. This is the 3500K colour temperature that's a warm white which is ideal for full spectrum growing. Uh, ADCRI and it's the top bin model it's uh, the CD bin, which means it's the highest efficiency uh, LED that Cree currently have available uh, in this size, in this uh, power uh, range. To give it a run for its money, we're going to course compare, and we've got the Luminous, the CXM32 uh, Gen3, and uh, we're going to look at the two of these side by side and see which performs better in terms of power output. To test the LEDs we have taken the Cree and the Luminous and mounted them into the Migro heatsink and we have used the same lenses on top and we have hung them at exactly the same hanging height over a target test area. We've measured then that test area, we've taken 64 measurements of the PPFD or the power output uh, reaching the target area from each of the LEDs. Both run within a watt of each other, so both run at about 83 watts. And in addition, we used our spectral radiometer by Sensitech to measure the spectral output uh, from each of the lights, and we can go and have a look at the um, results now. The full test results are down below in the description if you want to see the detail. But the Luminous and the Cree both were close to their specification in terms of CRI. The Cree was 84, the Luminous was 83 CRI. In terms of colour temperature, the Cree was 3675, the Luminous 3476, so both in line with their specifications. For the nominal wattage, this is from the data sheet now. The Cree is 86, the Luminous is higher at 112 watts. And at their nominal wattages, the Cree specifies a minimum of 12,000 lumen, could be more, but it's minimum 12,000, and the Luminous at their nominal wattage, 16,565. So the Cree is 138 lumens per watt in efficiency terms, and the Luminous is 165 lum uh, lumens per watt. So in lumen terms, the Luminous is about 20% more official at the nominal uh, wattage. So we're going to run them both at um, around the Cree nominal wattage and let's see what happens then. So, so we, we have, we're running the Cree at 83 watts and the Luminous at eight, just over 83 watts. Uh, we've taken the power readings and as you can see the improvement in efficiency or the difference in efficiency from a lumen point of view carries over to the power point of view. So the, the Luminous is again sufficient, uh, significantly more efficient from a PPFD per watt or a power efficiency point of view than the Cree. So this difference is not exclusive to, to Luminous, um, it's just the LED we're happening to use at the time. Uh, we've looked at, at Bridge Lux uh, in the past and at Lumi LEDs, both excellent um, global branded products and beat Cree for efficiency. So it's uh, always surprising to me that people are so sort of dogmatic about Cree and wanting to have Cree LEDs when, um, when they're not at the moment the, the superior in terms of efficiency. And when you look at their lifetime expectancy and guarantees and all that other stuff, um, you know, you, as long as you're going for a larger branded product, it um, it shouldn't uh, Cree doesn't give you any particular advantage over any other LED. So uh, all the details will be below in the description. And um, if you have any questions or comments, please let me know. Cheers.